folks. I've always wanted to do that. We're playing a, a new game. It came out this week. It's called Tiny Folks. I found it when I was browsing a website called Steam 250, where you can see simmering under the radar gems that have positive reviews are generating a lot of attention, but maybe haven't hit critical mass yet. The way I understand Tiny Folks, first off, 100% positive reviews with 76 reviews. Lots of references to Darkest Dungeon in those reviews. $4 on Steam. Easy enough. The game saves automatically after each action. New game. Choose a name for your ruler. Billbog. I will play on normal. This is the intended Tiny Folks experience. Okay. It all began long ago. Our land was peaceful, but cosmic forces arrived. For 45 days, dark entities ravaged the land. A powerful artifact was discovered. Are you an artifact with an I sort of gamer or an artifact with an E? An artifact with an E gamer is someone who likes video games. An artifact with an I streamer is someone who likes watching Morbius on Twitch. A crown led to a king. Evil forces vanished. The common folks rejoiced. But dark thoughts remained. Your Majesty, quick, take shelter. We're being at Oh! Drag me to hell, Sam Raimi's magnum opus. Well, well, well. Only two tiny folks to defend such a powerful artifact. How cute. You will never obtain a thing from me, evil creature. In that case, I'll take the crown from your dead skull. Guards, kill him. Okay, I can. I know what I'm doing. We have a knife, it's small but sharp. We have a shirt, it's soft and comfortable, and no artifact. It's James! Why is James crying? Okay, I'll click the sword. I'm, we can stop doing this. You know, we don't, we don't have to read everything every time. Evil sorcerer creates a dark storm above two targets. Now I am Billbog, okay? I could use smite to burn the target. I could heal us. Or I could have orders plus one attack for all allies for 10 turns. Okay, so first step, we're gonna burn the target. Enjoy your two burn. Now, James, what do you have? Charge, strike, and war cry. Let me move my camera. Thank you for the, the advice and the intelligence. I'll put myself down here for now. Um, I mean, we gotta spend some of our pow here. Let me get a strike for 20 damage, please. James has been hit with dark tentacles and he is dead. I have also been killed. All right, I was kind of like worried a little bit too much about the strategy, I think. I'm going to assume we're supposed to lose that one. Our king was defeated. Dark forces took hold of the crown. A blast of wrath and perversion shook the land. As the crown's power was corrupted, our king disappeared. And the cosmic time started to tick. Someday our land will be destroyed. But far from the crown, the king remains. And in a moment of absolute need, he saw a town where peace still existed. Isn't it crazy how without a crown, a king is just a guy? It really makes you think. Okay, I love, the other thing I loved when I saw screenshots of this game is that there's always the word folks on the screen, which makes for a really easy punchline opportunity if you can't think of what to say. I will recruit folks. Okay, we got Brendan. A player unknown has joined the squad. Where's his frying pan? Okay, then we got this button right here. Melee training. Shall we? Select a folk. Okay, Bren Brendan for 100 gold. I could raise your HP. Sure, there you go. Ends tomorrow. Let's go back to the town's end. Sele select, wait, I would like to go back to the town. I, I thought there was other stuff we could click on. Uh, okay, we got Brendan and Bilbog. Okay, hold on. Artifacts, none. Components, none. Okay, that's easy enough. Okay, I'll select my folks. I select Billbog. Billbog can go at the front. And then I'll, I'll go exploring because we have no items. Okay, fair enough. I see the Darkest Dungeon comparison for sure. Fairy Forest, home of countless plants and strange creatures. Uh, Brendan is training right now, okay? It's me against a mushroom who is poison immune. I can deal five damage, or I could apply two burn. For now, I choose to apply five damage. 
You have unleashed poison gas. I'm, I'm being hit for four. I'm gonna attack you again. I have been hit for four. You've released spores on Bilbog. I'm gonna attack you again. You're poisoned. I have four poison again. I'm going to kill you, and then I, I feel okay about this. You won the battle. Current bounty is Roots X2. Next battle. Is this... I, I love a game where you choose your own limit. Because you could always go just one more round. 15 HP bear. I mean, I'm a simple guy. I think for right now, attacking's doing a lot. Bear roars at Bilbog. Lowers my attack. Okay, now it's going to take me a little longer. So guess what? Maybe, maybe we're at a break-even point for a burn. Bilbog remains poisoned, by the way. I have been slashed. Bear is burning. For seven? Okay, you're g possibly going to die to burn. So I choose to heal myself. Did I take a little damage? You slash me a little bit. And then you burn for seven. Maybe burn does seven per stack. Next battle. You're about to face the boss. No sweat, man. No sweat. A tree? It's burn weak? All right. I think I should burn it. Now, if something's weak, does it take 14 damage? 17 damage. Okay. You know what? Enjoy another stack of burn. I am bleeding. You are cutting me with your thorns. I am lowering the volume when the battle's complete. I will smite you once more. I mean, yes, yeah, smite you once more. I have to lower it. It's too, it's too loud. You have won the battle. Look at this. We got roots, small shroom, mad rabbit's foot, sap, and potion. Go to town. Brendan became a warrior. Good for you, player unknown. If you'll allow me to go and just... There you go. That's, that's fine. That's good enough. <clears throat> sap, sap, I leave, sap. Very funny. Hold on, I have to look at my folks, okay? We got Brendan. Bill Bog is hurt. Can I recruit folks? We have Baba! Baba's a farmer with a knife and a shirt. Baba is him. Okay, he was free to recruit. Next step. Take me back to the barracks. We can upgrade it. Sure, why not? Costs a thousand gold and twenty wood. You can train two experienced folks at a time, increase max population by one, and learn how to use shields. Sure. Let's do that. Let's invest. Upgrading ends tomorrow. Can I put can I put Baba in here for a minute and, and turn him into a warrior instead of a folk? Sounds good to me. And then the forge. We can upgrade weapons. Costs 50. We don't have that kind of scratch right now. It's fine. Okay. We have an artifact now, right? A rabbit's foot plus two defense. Okay. I get it. It's minimalist darkest dungeon. We can heal 50 HP to a single folk. Okay. Drag it down there. Drag it down there. Select folks. Well, Brendan can handle this one by himself, I'm sure. I'm waiting until we get classes when, when the real complexity unlocks. Okay. Where do we go? Goblin Valley or Carrot Farm? We got to go Goblin Valley. It's a little easier. Okay. We got two goblins in Goblin Town. They got 25 HP each. We can buff allies attack. Not necessary. Or we could do a charge attack to hit two enemies at once. You do five damage. I think we want two charges. No. I think we want a strike followed by a charge. Strike the front goblin. Ho ho, my lad. Go go, my lad. I'm b barely familiar, but you know what? Look at this. The optimum distribution. We don't have... Oh, the only heal we have is the potion. Okay, it's almost like they designed the start of the game to introduce mechanics to you slowly at a very uh, approachable level. Who would have thought? Next battle. Okay, we have a rat at the back. We have an ogre at the front. I mean, you got to kill that rat immediately with a piercing attack. Our attack has been lowered. You got 20 HP. Holy cow. With minus 2 attack, guess what? Now I got plus 10 attack. 
or plus five attack at least. That's just quite a nasty hit, but guess what? Okay, you got 20 HP. First attack, no sweat. You trampled me. Next attack, you're dead. Oh no, because it only lasted for one turn. Okay, next attack, you're dead. We got string, we got nails. You are about to face the boss. I'm ready, okay? What's the boss? Is the king of the goblins? It's boss Nass. 60 HP Goblin King. I would like to use a potion on myself. You have attacked me for 20. That's fine. I can live with that. I'm going to attack. I have to I have to live for 12 turns. I have to do 12 attacks. Brendan is going to die. You've thrown a spear at me. You've thrown another spear at me. Maybe I could live. I don't know. I, I guess I should have saved some of my power for this. We're on 35 HP. Not sweating it yet. A spear. We're on 30 HP. Not sweating it yet. We're on 25 HP. Not sweating it yet. Now we're on 20 HP. We use a potion. We're attacking. I mean, we just got to send it, man. Please throw more spears. Come on. No, Brendan. Brendan has died. You've lost your bounty and your equipment. But Baba became a warrior. Okay, that's my mistake. That, honestly, that one's on me. Would the recruit Dr. Will? I actually wouldn't mind upgrading this. Oh, I guess we got no bounty there, so that makes actually perfect sense. Fair enough. Well, I guess, you know what? For now, why don't you just send me out to the damn town's end? And let's, let's put Baba and Will on the damn squad. Let's take two units this time. And hold, oh, a shop, okay. We don't have enough gold for anything, but you could buy artifacts. You could buy items. You can buy items. Okay. We have no potions, right? Okay. Don't we have an artifact we could give to somebody? Like, I, I plus two defense? Sure. I think having... We can only put it on Bilbog. We can't put it on any of our other folks. Oh, we can put it on our other folks. Okay. Baba, you got a little rabbit's foot there because you're up at the top. Okay. Explore me. Take me back to Goblin Town. This time we got it. We know the math too. Okay, there's a rat at the back. That means you always charge first. You've attacked Baba. Will gets to go next. He can throw tomatoes, deals 10 damage and minus two attack for three turns. Heals or five, plus five attack for three turns. I think we just do five damage and we save our power to debuff the final boss. Like even here, I'm like, Save your power. It's it's valuable. You have 10 HP. This is perfect. Next battle. Okay, this is a little crazy. I would still say we want to do a, a charge to kill a rat. In fact, we'll probably do several charges. A goblin has bitten Will, but that's okay. We can only do five damage to the unit at the front, but that's okay because that then the charge will get two kills anyway. Maybe the enemies have scaled based on team size. You know what? It's an interesting idea to be sure. Then we attack. Easy mode. The final boss. Okay, now we got two units. You killed my friend. You killed Bernice. No shot. Step one, we have 20 power. You know we're going straight for strike. We need to do that kind of damage. You've slashed Baba with your claws, big whoop. Now, I am going to deal 10 damage and lower your attack for three turns. Enjoy these tomatoes. Now I'm going to strike you once more. And now we're on actually like easy mode. You have 10 HP? Okay, I'll deal 10 damage to you. It's that simple. Backpack and a rosary? Take me back to town. Nothing happened in town. They introduced the Darkest Dungeon Facebook feed. I'm ready. I understand how to play a game like this. All right, folks. 
We would like to recruit a folk, please. Sam, welcome. Then, what's this? The tavern? We could upgrade it to get more folks daily. And we already have an upgraded barracks. So we can, can we trade, or can we train two folks at once? And we could trade, uh, train one to be a shielder. I think we got to upgrade the, the inn first so we can recruit more units on a daily b Oh, it takes one day to complete. Okay. That way we can get two units. We can get one in shield and one in warrior training and still have an, we, we have a max population size of four, but okay, I see it, I see it. I'm, I'm understanding now. Now I think we should, let me look at my folks real quick. We only have Bilbog and Sam. I think we should just let it fly then. But we could maybe upgrade uh, Bilbog's weapon. You know what, let's upgrade Sam's weapon. Let's turn it into a, no, I think we're gonna be fine. Upgrade Baba's weapon. He's the king right now, and then he'll be ready for our next our next battle anyway, right? Like, when is he good? He's weapon. His his status is weapon. I guess that probably takes one day or something. Ends tomorrow. Okay. I don't think I can train the guys who are hurt, right? No, you can't. That would be nice, though. Okay. Swap the artifact off of Baba. You know what? You know what? This is this is genius tech. What is this? 20 max HP plus 5% gold during combat. Oh, baby. Now we're talking. We would not like to ex explore with an empty team. I'm going to select my folks. Bilbog the King. Welcome to the front. Sam, welcome here. Give me a, Let me get a quick artifact check. Plus 5% gold during combat. That's going to go to the King. And then... Sam is he's coming with us. He's only got 80 HP. Let's give him an extra 20. How about that? We can take a third unit too, but I don't have a population size for that. Hot Oasis, Arid and Suffocating, or the Carrot Farm? I we have a farmer. Take me to the carrot farm, please. Let's see what we got. We got a 15 HP frog and a 15 HP rooster. I mean, immediately, you gotta throw a little burn out here. Frog skin becomes slippery. Plus one defense, but the frog is burning. Uh, you have plus one defense, you have eight HP. Guess what? Have some tomatoes. So that you're dead. That way we have to deal with less attacks. Now you have 15 HP. Honestly, I think I'm... Rather than do five damage, putting the burn on you just seems sensible because you take seven. Rooster has summoned the chicken. Oh, no. And honestly, you got eight HP. We deal five damage. I don't want to waste our power before the final boss. So let's just tough it out. The chicken has pecked Sam for two damage. That's nothing. Let me get a simple attack out there. You've slashed at me with your claws. Let me get a simple attack out there. Let me get a simple attack out there. Easy mode. Three flowers. So it's a little like sap. Not, it's not like sap at all. What are you talking about? This is a manual battler. This one is three rounds, then the boss. Ah, oh, that explains this, uh, explains the screen at the top. Makes perfect sense. Yep, manual sap. Listen, you don't even know what you're talking about. Pig burns for seven. Will gets the kill. One. I hate to do it. Obviously, you gotta go. Minus 10. I would like you to heal the king. You can't do that, huh? It only targets self. Well, then just attack. Uh, I mean, eat the food. That That's what I meant. <laughs> just eat the food. Wait, yo, you can heal yourself anyway. No sweat. You can heal anybody. Okay, that's great intel. The king can heal himself. No big deal. Get smacked. I'm trying to save my power so that we have the ability to debuff the boss. Even though it looks like we're, we're facing problems as a result of that. I, I promise you in time, we will appear to be a true genius. There you go. We got some flowers. We got some leather. We got three units. Dude, a pig is like the most annoying unit in the game. But so are the chickens. 
Let me get an attack out here. Let me get an attack out here. It's that simple. We need some AoE on this squad. This is it's a war of attrition right now. Now we can put burn on the enemies at the rear. So I think burn does seven damage per stack and it loses one stack per turn, but it only goes to a maximum of two. Seems sensible to me. So let's put some damage up on the front real quick. Is that not true? I mean, it's, that seems right to me. It's seven damage per turn for two turns. Sorry, not, oh, did I say seven damage per stack? That's not what I meant. You do, you should you should only apply burn when an enemy doesn't have a burn. Is the way it seems to me so far. I guess is what I'm trying to say. I see it's a little like GeoGuessr. It it has some similarities with the game you may know as GeoGuessr. Yes, I would say that's that's definitely true. Of course, the pig is dead. Okay, we have 600 gold. It's the final boss battle. I'm more than ready. It's a bull, but he's sleeping. Ah, uh, he's awake. 70 HP. Step one, heal yourself for 30. You've trampled two targets, big whoop. Next step, we damage for 10 and give minus two attack for three turns. Okay, this is the weakest trample I've ever seen. Then we apply burn to you. You've, you've got some bleed. That's no sweat, man. You're done. Then we apply more tomatoes. You're at minus four attack. Sam bleeds a little bit. Bull is drawn to Sam's blood. Okay, we got to make a decision here. Sam is at 32 HP. How much power does he have? 10. You need a heal, my friend. Sam doesn't have the power to heal. Oh, he does have the power to heal himself. For some reason, I thought it cost 20. It's all right. We throw some tomatoes at you. You're still at a minus four. You're drawn to the blood. You take a little more damage. Now we apply a smite back to you. The bull is burning. Sam no longer can heal himself. He sends out a little attack. We've also been bleeding. That's all right. You're so close. You're, you're on 7 HP. I mean, I we have to do it. We have to make sure that, that Sam... Sam has 28 HP. He's fine. Get, get smitten. Get smote. You're attracted to my blood. Whatever. Get your free attack. Do some damage. Never mind. You're dead. It's that easy. 2,000 gold and some good shoes. Baba upgraded his knife to a dagger. Baba has knife. In upgraded to level two. Okay, now is where things are gonna pop, okay? First off, look at your folks. Everybody's hurt. <laughs> what is Calm Knight? Heal your folks faster? Okay. Well, feels like the... Maybe start with the ones who are closest to getting out. We'll recruit folks. 150? We need to, though. Because we need to be able to... Send somebody out. Can I dismiss a folk? Can I dismiss Sam? Can I, Sam, I need you to leave. I'm sorry. I need to hire another another folk. Maybe I could go back and farm an easier mission. Okay, let's let's see what we got. Start start with the obvious. Okay, weapon upgrades. We got Sam and Timmy. Sam was just on a mission with us. Go ahead and take some support, okay? We do want to maybe buy something. You can build a magic area. You could build a temple. You could build a camp. You could build a slum. Let's start. Let's go in order. Let's start with the magic area. Unlocks magic training. Cost us two gems. Big whoop. Still got 1,600 gold. Let me get a camp. 400 gold, 10 wood. No sweat. Temple, 600 gold. Let's do it. Slum, 300 gold, 10 wood. No sweat. It's going to be a busy day. And then we just... Timmy?
Can I can I go back to the fairy forest? You don't have to explore. I guess we could just take him out. And then like pass time away for and, and just let people heal. Or just hit sleep. Yeah, you don't have to explore. Sam upgraded. Magic Ariums out there. We got five of five folks. Sam and Bilbog are still hurt, but that's okay. We're going to have a calm night for, for Bilbog and a calm night for Sam. We have 300 gold. We can upgrade. If we upgrade their weapon, can they still go out on a mission? No, because their status effect becomes weapon. You're right, we should have trained Timmy when we were there too. We got Baba, Sam sleeping. Hold on, look at, let me look at my folks. Three folks available, and we can take three on a mission, which seems sensible, because our units are not that good. I don't think we should train anybody yet. Let's, let's just take a look at what we got. We could send someone to be a magician. I guess we should train them. We could send someone to be like a healer. We could send someone to be a hunter. Send someone to be a sneaky miscreant. Okay. Well then, I know you only have 45 days too, and we're on day six of 45. I would love, we have we have a lot of heals already. I, would, I think I would love a, um, a ranger of some sort. So guess what? I mean, you look cool, don't get me wrong. That turns you into a captain. This turns you into a ranger. Let's, let's... Should spread it around. You're probably right. Okay. Of course Timmy had a bow. And then maybe a... Maybe a sneaky miscreant. Maybe Will could be a sneaky miscreant. And then honestly, I, I hate to tell you this, I think I'm going to take another day off. Can't afford anything. I'm going to take one more day off. Now let's see where we stand. Everybody's healthy and available. We got 100 gold. Let me think about this. Sam needs to train. I honestly, I, Sam, how do you feel about becoming a shield, a shielder for 100 gold? And then, yeah, class combination. That seems cool. We need to go out on a mission today. <laughs> for sure. Let's not send the king because we'll probably end up rolling two stack tomorrow. So let's send a, a warrior at the front. Let's put Timmy in the third position. And then let's look at our folks. Make sure you're equipping some artifacts. Okay, remove all. Timmy's on the team. Dude, dude, dude. Special abilities cost minus five power. Welcome. Sam, you're just like a guy. Give me some extra gold. Will, you're at the... Wait, you're not at the front. B Baba's at the front. Will, what? You're not even... Are you even doing anything? No, wait, hold on. It's Sam. Sam's not doing anything. Sam's Sam's just, the, uh, he's along for the ride. The thief gets a little extra gold. And Baba gets the extra HP because he's at the front. Okay, look at that. Explore me. Ancient ruins or hot oasis? Sitopia. Take me to the ancient ruins, please. Some damn zombies. Immune bleed, immune poison. Okay, now we can start to think about the team buffs, I think. Dude, it really is like a micro darkest dungeon. 50 HP, 30 HP, 30 HP. So we got charges, you do a little more damage now. I don't know what else our units have. Can I, I can't see. Okay, you just gotta remember. All right, I'm gonna save some of my power. I'm just going to smack you for seven. You have bidden me. I have become poisoned. You have healed. Minus three attack and three defense for all enemies for three turns. Stun the target. Deal seven damage and bleed the target. Ignore attack and defense. I mean, stun the target for five seems kind of incredible. Let's stun the... I know they just attacked. 
I'm gonna stun the unit at the front anyway, just so we can kill them and hopefully not get any more poison stacked on us. Now you, shoot for 15, arrow stab for three, aim to lower someone's defense for three turns, or a fire arrow. I mean, shoot for 15 just seems, oh, but you can only shoot the two units that are further behind. <laughs> I don't know if I can even hit the third position with anything else, so we'll shoot the ghost for 15. You've thrown a bone at me. Who throws a shoe, honestly? Charge will do 12 damage to two enemies. It won't kill the ghost. Honestly, I think we need to do a, a, a quick little power smack on this, this skeleton up here. Baba's poison for a little bit. Zombie's no longer stunned. That's okay. How much damage do you do? Five? That's nothing. You do nothing. You do seven and bleed. Honestly, I hate to spend this much power. I think a little seven bleed on the front guy, though, to get him to get him weak enough where we can one-tap him with someone else. Scary thought for Timmy. Okay, we know we're shooting position two. You always, you prioritize killing units. Strike will hit you for seven. Charge will hit you for 12. You're not going to die to the bleed, though. I think we got to strike you. We spent a lot of power on our first encounter, unfortunately, but... It's okay, we still got HP. Now we gotta, like, not spend any power at all. A little arrow stat. I guess, you know what? Maybe I'd rather lower your defense than, than just hit you for th three measly damage. We could flee before the boss. You know what? That's true. We could flee before the boss. If we have to. But the, I don't know. Maybe this doesn't seem that bad. This is the exact same fight. Well, I think what we want, we want like an AoE unit so that we can buff all allies and then have the plus five attack go to like an attack that hits all four enemies or all three enemies. This team also needs kind of a healer as well. That's true. Okay, I mean, we gotta, we gotta do damage. So let's plan like we're gonna leave anyway. And let's dance like there's nobody watching. Let me get a, an early strike. You're probably gonna heal up when you poison me anyway, now that I think about it. Five damage to the front unit. No thanks. Let me get a stun on this ghost. Then let me let me take a shot at the ghost. Then you get to attack. Do uh, our archer is almost dead? That's horrible news. I well, okay. Then we're just gonna charge. We're gonna spend all our power because we're getting out of here anyway. Whoa! Ghost body becomes ethereal. Plus three defense. Well, that's fine. I will bribe the back unit so that it doesn't kill my archer. And then I will shoot the skeleton. Or, I don't know, man. You kind of gotta... Like, flaming arrow the ghost so that it definitely dies to, to something. And then you gotta go. But the, I, I don't think we can kill you in time. We just gotta hope you don't attack our archer. What the hell? Good AI? I'm not used to good AI in these games. Okay, next battle. I mean, go to town. <laughs> Timmy is dead, but Sam became a guard. Okay, folks. Recruit folks. 150 gold for Isaac. How could I not? That's a gimme. Sorry, Arkma. 474 gold is not a ton here. But first, calm night. You got to put folks in the bed. Baba goes to the bed. We got three units ready. Not even grieving Timmy. Dude, I'm too focused on the damn pod. Hold on. Do I have any water left? I got a couple squeezes. <laughs> Told you. Okay. With Bilbo, we're going to crush anyway. I'm not concerned about that. Can we upgrade? No, it's way too expensive. 
But we could probably do some weapon upgrades. Sam's shield could be upgraded. Do I feel comfortable sending two units? I don't think so. I think we want to expand the, uh, the inn so that we can have a larger population. Anything gives us larger population. Population is a serious like bottleneck right now. For now, we have no items. Send me out on this mission. Sam at the front, Bilbog behind, Isaac behind that. We could always do an earlier mission, you're not wrong. Now d run through your checklist. Artifacts, remove all. Bill Bog, take some defense. Isaac, take some HP. Guard, take some gold. Reverse that. Guard, take some HP. There you go. Yeah, we did lose Timmy's artifact. No shop this time, explore me. Isaac got the rosary. Is this a crossover episode? Okay, take me back to the carrot farm. I'm right. We can do this. We'll farm it up a little. Der, der, der. Two rams, huh? Protect. Plus two defense to all allies except you for two turns. Deals 20 damage, but hurts this folk for five. Grapple. Move the target to the front. Shield bash for five. Okay. We're going to start with a simple shield bash. Take five damage. You headbutt me, big whoop. Now, we know how smite works. Here's the thing, we can do 20 damage to you next time easily. So why don't we simply burn the unit at the back? And we can continuously heal our guard anyway. Magic trick for five damage, 10 damage and minus two attack, five damage and burns target, or just deal 20 damage. Holy cow, I mean, that's incredible. Let's start with the magic trick here though. Then we get to go. We should have hit the unit at the back because we're about to hit you for 20. So we that was unnecessary overkill. Ram is burning. I mean, this is, this is easy money. You're actually just dead. Sure. Well, do, you know what? I'll spend 10 power. Sure. Just to keep you from attacking. Why not? There's two berries. Chicken, chicken, rooster. There's a part of me that thinks it would be nice to move the rooster to the front, but I don't know why. You have 10 HP. I refuse to take five damage to make that happen. So just go ahead and hit me for two instead. For now, why don't you give me the kill? You should probably learn it's maybe best to attack the second unit in line if you can't kill them in one attack. For now, I think this is an easy fight. I think we just we just power save. Just save as much power as possible. Now we got a rooster. Now doesn't a rooster make more chickens? I don't know. My my farm science is not uh, what it used to be. How much HP you got? Ten. I'm just gonna shield bash you. Tank one attack. Save power. We got we got a lot a lot of fight left in us. Rooster's burning. Rooster's dead. Chicken slash me with his claws. Big whoop. Get attacked. It's, this is an eco round. It's it, it, it's as true as that. It's an eco round. Berries and flowers. Okay. I think we could just shoot the rat with our wizard. You got 15 HP. I think this is a great opportunity for a shoulder bump. Which means we get a free attack, right? No, it goes straight to you. Okay. I've got a lot to learn. You know what? For 10, why don't you give me a quick heal on our on our guard? He's been doing great work. Now, the rat only has 5 HP. It's a great opportunity for a, a magician's trick. You have 25. A simple shield bash. Big whoop. A simple smite. Do the three card Monty. In jog something real quick. I'm just going to attack you. If I got to do another shoulder bash, I'll do another shoulder bash. I don't think it's necessary though. Okay, you're dead. Now we fight the boss. I'm very ready. This is not, this is not, there's no boss. Burn weak, immune to poison, immune to bleed. Okay, we have a hornet. First hornet is dead. Isaac has been stung. He has four turns of poison, big whoop. 
I think we're just, we're smacking because we can get a kill with our next two units. Isaac's been scared, minus two attack. Okay, now we can no longer get a kill, but, well, not without using power. Okay, so guess what? We get to go next anyway. I'm going to use Isaac's incredible DPS to hit the Scarecrow at the back. So then we go next. I will shield or shoulder bump you to make sure you're dead. Then we, get, we do not get to go again. One of these days I'll figure that out. You are burn weak, get smited, and then get sparked again. Kieris. Easy mode. The shop is at the town's end. Great news. Dude, I'm having a good time. I slipped right back into it. Okay, I'm gonna have Sam and uh, Isaac rest. Sam because he's on two days. Isaac because he was a freaking champ in the last one. We want higher population size. What the heck is Theo Loggy? Theology! I was messing with you. Let's upgrade. I, honestly, I had a great time with the wizard there. Let's let's get a staff upgrade. Train two folks at the same time. Unlocks magic staff upgrades. Takes a day. And oh yeah, check the shop. So true. Plus five bleed attack. Minus 10 attack for all enemies for two turns. Water bucket for plus two burn defense. I feel like I need some more... I need some enumeration on what plus five bleed attack is. Does that mean bleed attacks get plus five bleed? Or does that mean every attack gets plus five bleed? Because if so, that seems insane. Bleed does plus five damage. I must have a unit that has bleed. Like, my thief must have bleed, right? Now, we only have Baba and Will on this one. So, I think we're going to have to farm an earlier mission again. I th Dude, it's like XCOM style. Like, I feel like we might run out of time. Okay, Will's on the team. He has 90 HP. Let me get that super bleed. Baba's on the team. Honestly, I think you might need the plus 20 max HP. I hate to just go straight back to Goblin Town, but I think it's got to be done. Cyclop. We got three waves. I mean, you're going to hit pretty hard, I'm sure. You deal seven damage. I think we got to we gotta strike, come out of the gate strong. You've trampled two targets. Deals 12 damage and bleeds. Let's just see how this works, okay? 12 damage. A three stack of bleed. Now we could kill you, but I want to see how much damage bleed does. It did five. It did seven plus five. Oh, did I did I miss a trigger? Maybe. Okay, this is an easy mode. We know we're doing a charge. The killer rat. You have 13 HP. This is where you start sending stuns out there. So you're going to go next, so you get stunned. Oh, the attack originally did 7, but now it does 12 first. Okay, I understand now. Let me get another charge out here. You've thrown a spear at me, big whoop. This time you're just going to get attacked. The initial attack that inflicted bleed does five extra damage. Okay. All right. I guess plus five damage on every bleed attack probably would have been too much. But that's why I bought it. <laughs> it's because I thought it was going to be too much. Okay, you've trampled me. Congrats. I mean, the next step is very simple. We bribe the back line so they don't get to attack this turn. Then we go... And we use our last bit of energy to make sure that the ogre dies. Oh, we could have just charged you instead, but whatever. 
then you get to go. And then we just use all of our incredible bleed abilities on you. And we just smack you around a little bit. You probably just died of the you died of bleed right here. Big whoop. On the next attack. Okay, we absolutely need to do like a difficult mission. We can now take more folks though, which is huge. Like we we need to progress though. You mada farmer, you. Hey, you mada farmer, you. No, nah, 150 gold seems like an incredible, uh, a small price to pay to not have to spend an extra night uh, training them. So let's see, we have 372 gold. Let me look at my folks. We already have four we can send out on a mission and we can send all four. I'd like to send all four, but that means we do have one person that's open and available to us. Maybe this new warrior? No, it does no, that's not how that works. Hold on. Maybe we could send 3 and try our best. Let take hold on. I'm getting overwhelmed. Heal your your weak folks. Then, let's look at what we got here. I feel like I would love a wizard monk. Let's see how that looks. Become a mage with a wand and a shirt. We could get a monk. I gotta admit, he's looking pretty cool. Hold on. What else could we get? What about a a, a a wizard hunter? Becomes a druid. I sleep. You become a captain. You become an archer. What else we got? What about a... Well, we could staff upgrade Isaac, which would honestly be kind of sick, although it would take a day. But we have our king with us. Maybe it's okay. Maybe we can get away with this. No, we should train somebody to be cool. We should make a cool unit. What about a an occult? Dude, I'm sold. Okay, we're going to turn Isaac into an occultist. It just fits thematically. You're right, get a cool guy. I can't believe I was thinking about not getting a cool guy. And then... Make sure you got your artifacts set up. The king, I don't think it really matters. Nobody here has a bleed attack, I think, anyway. So the frontline unit, who is our guard, maybe should have extra defense or extra... Yeah, but just give him extra HP. Billbog, why don't you just take the gold? And you, why don't you take the defense? Okay. And then explore me. I do feel like I'm... I don't feel like I'm doing a horrible job, but I feel like I'm going too slow. Okay, I'm going back to the ancient ruins, man. I think we can do it. Skeletons immune to bleed. Shoulder bump for 20. Grapple to move a unit to the front. Plus two defense to all allies except you for two turns. Okay, we got to get some kills out there immediately. But we also have a boss to fight later. You inflict some nasty stuff. I think it would be nice if you died before you could attack twice. Because you inflict poison in some circumstance. Ah, this is it, because then you can charge. You get a kill and a little damage on the unit behind. Okay. But be a little stingier with your power, okay? You're immune to bleed, but not immune to burn. Let's get some burn on you. Oh, zombie does, not skeleton. Of course. Okay, HP is a resource we can afford to, to chill with. We're not that worried about that. H HP is something we can easily work around. And then honestly, what, you're on six HP? I'm, I'm just gonna kill you. I know we could charge, but let's engage in some power saving. You're not immune to burn somehow. Burning skeleton, get burned. I don't feel the need to kill you. I feel like this is a great spot. Great time to save some power. Take damage. Take damage. I'm gonna have Bilbog heal himself. Hey, Kong Sver, 
Thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. Much appreciated. Skeleton can't sleep because his bed's on fire. One flower. Okay, good first fight. Now, zombies have got to go early. But here's the thing, okay? A freaking zombie heals. So we might not want to attack it first. Maybe... Maybe the zombie can't do anything if it's not in position one. Something worth thinking about. What if we use the grapple to move a ghost to the front instead? And maybe the zombie can't do much from position two. That's my hope, at least. Whether or not it will work it remains to be seen. But then I think we could do some charges so the zombie's a little weaker by the time it gets to come up to the... Okay, it still bit me, and he's still healed. It, it does make perfect sense. Now, honestly, I think we got to smite the zombie so it dies before it can come out any faster. You have 18 HP. This is a great time for a shoulder bump. It was worth the try. I stand by it. It's a lot of poison. It's an awful lot of poison. 43. I really want to save some power for the boss. Stop throwing a bone at Billbog, okay? The man's been through a lot. You have 33 HP. I'm going to bump you as much as I can bump you. I know it's not going to kill you, but I got to do some serious damage to you. You barfed on two targets. Not that big of a deal. Get smacked and killed. I'm a believer that, like, we can beat the boss. We have a reasonable amount of power remaining. We have a lot of heals we can still do with our king. Sure, we got lots, lots of stacks of poison. There's no joke in there. Quick attack. Heal yourself. That, that, that might be a game over uh, if that guy dies. So just chill out. Save some power. Big whoop. You're burning. You're dead. We win. Next battle. I'm ready. I think we got a chance, man. He's immune to bleed. It's just a big skeleton. We really got to do damage to him as soon as possible. That's, that's all I know about this. You've moved me around slightly. No big deal. Except that that means I get to go again, which is actually kind of sick. Because then I can do another one of these real quick. Then you get to go again, right? And you've shuffled them once more. So our warrior never got to attack. You know what we say about that? We say based. Get smited. Full party wipe incoming. Listen. You don't even know of what you speak. Here's 22 damage for you. 18 damage. You're burning. This would be a turn I would... All I can do is shield bash you for five. It's horrendous. Okay, there you go. Shuffle them around. You get to go next. 71, 34. We have to smite you on this turn. Three targets have been burned. That's a little more than I was willing to give up right there, but that's okay. Who gets to go next? You get to go next. Okay, enjoy your five damage shield bash. 28 HP, two stacks of burning. I'm gonna smite you. Wait, there's no way, if we, st if we heal too early, we just create a situation where everybody's gonna die slowly. The heal is not the way, I would rather lose a unit and, and keep our chances of winning alive here. What is your HP? 76? That's so bad. As long as our king lives, I consider this a victory. Don't at me. The, the only way we're getting out of this is if we kill this boss. The only way we kill this boss is by keeping the burn stacks up there. Nobody else on our team is doing any damage. Okay, finally. Finally, our warrior got to attack. 
yes, you're probably dead. Seven. Okay, you're on 26 life. I have to give you a chance to stay in here now. Don't. Don't. Don't strike Bill Bog. He's the king. <laughs> 22 damage. We have no power remaining. I still don't think we can win. We get struck. I mean, we have to like crit you, but that's not even something that exists in this game, right? Don't strike me. Don't strike me. How dare you? All your folks are dead. You've lost your bounty and your equipment. Okay, okay. So first we're going to slash marker. Tiny folks. 